Yeah, so I haven't been on a date in a while, um, but I'm excited. Um, my friends told me to go on this website, so we'll see what happens. I'm hopeful. So I'm really, 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 really looking forward to this. Um, I don't have much luck with women. They really tend to stay away from me, but this website's hooking me up. Aaliyah seems like a really cool girl. She seems beautiful. I think tonight is my night. Hi, I'm Aaliyah. Hey, nice to meet what's you. up? Hi. Nice to meet you. Same here. Okay. Yeah, you can't just touch somebody you don't know. It doesn't work like that. At that moment, I knew she was the one. So this was an interesting place to meet. Yeah, it's rated number one on Yelp, and I wanted to go here really badly. Plus, no other place gave me a reservation. Yeah, well, I noticed walking in that they serve fountain soda, like Mountain Dew and Coca-Cola, and it's pretty gross because that stuff's not good for you. And the places that I go to usually make their own sodas. It's much healthier. Well, it's gluten-free, and your profile says you're gluten-free. Gluten-free? I'm so happy that you mentioned that because I just started the gluten-free diet. Um, and it's changed my life. I mean, everything has gluten in it, so I have to get my groceries at Whole Foods and Trader Joe's, but I mean, besides the fact that it's extremely expensive, um, I know that it's extremely healthy. This cake doesn't have gluten. Yeah, no thank you. I'm good for, I'm good, I'm good. I'm still getting paid for this, right? So, Leah, on your dating profile, and tell me what you did. Uh, I'm really big about that stuff. Yeah, so I'm actually a graphic designer for a brand strategy company in Chelsea. Um, it's a startup. It's about 20 of us. Uh, but I was offered a few, you know, corporate gigs out of college. But, you know, going corporate's not my thing. So, yeah. But uh, what do you do? Uh, well, you can say uh, I'm a musician. Just bought a ukulele a month ago. Really okay. excited about that. Cool. So you've played places like Music Hall Williamsburg and... Mercury Lounge and Glass Lens, stuff like that. Well, here's the thing about that. Um, I'm banned from Mercury Lounge. Music Hall of Williamsburg will be one day a performing venue for us. I just formed the band five days ago, so yeah. it's, it's going to be a big opportunity soon, eventually. Yeah, but you don't live with your parents, right? No, of course not. I live with uh, five dudes. Oh, so do I. You gotta tell me what kind of music you listen to. I'm a big music person. Yeah, so right now I'm really into this band called Miami Horror. They're amazing. Um, but uh, MIA is my spirit animal. You know, like, I fly like people get high like planes. Like, that girl, you know, you know what I'm talking I about? I have no idea what you're doing. All right, well, what are you into then? <laughs> Radiohead, best band ever. Okay, way too mainstream. M83. Too commercial. Holy Ghost. Uh, I mean, they got way too big, way too fast. So. Everyone loves this band, Arcade Fire. I've never heard of Arcade Fire. Are you serious? Yeah. They did win a Grammy. Well, that's why I don't know, because I don't watch the Grammys. Yeah, I mean, I think it's safe to say that Julian's not the right guy for me, or um, any woman for that matter. Yeah. I had a hard time keeping up with her because she was so hot to the point that I was being sexist. What was the last movie you saw? It was a couple weeks ago um, at this really cute art house around the corner from here. Um, it was this French film called C'est La Vie. Um, it was really, really nice. Is it gonna be playing at any uh, big chain movie theaters? No, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be playing at an EMC or Lowe's or wherever you go see your movies. I mean, my favorite director usually has his movies come to those theaters. And is your favorite director Michael Bay or something? God, no. It's Wes Anderson. Oh my god, I love Wes Anderson. It's funny that you say that because a couple years ago I dated Jason Schwartzman to try to get a little closer to him, but it didn't work out too well. Well, what happened? I don't really want to talk about that right now. Well, I wouldn't mind dating Sofia Coppola. Don't you think she's a little too old for you? Soulmates. So what made you try IHateMeetingPeople.com? I mean, 
I really just didn't want to try it. Um, I was kind of forced by friends to try it because I'm not really good at the whole dating thing and I genuinely hate meeting people, so. I'm well, hoping today changes your mind about that. Um, I mean, unfortunately, I don't really think it did. I mean, going on these dates only, you know, justifies the fact that I'm better off alone. My last girlfriend told me the same thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry about that, but, you know, what can you do? Be my girlfriend? What the fuck? All right, well, this has been really fun and sufficiently awkward um, and a complete waste of my time. Uh, but it was great meeting you. Good luck on your search. Um, I'm gonna go home and delete my dating profile now. Will I ever see you again? Um, probably not. Do you want to come over and smoke weed then? Mm, okay. <laughs>